For the best prices and service on Pokemon TCG singles and products, check out ccgcastle.com and use promo code EVOLUTIONARIES-5 for 5% off your next order. What's going on, Pokemon fans? I'm Professor K. <laughs> <laughs> oh jeez, here we go again. <laughs> uh, uh, you okay back there? Why? I thought Halucha replaced this guy. Uh, <laughs> that doesn't mean I like him anymore. Oh, that's fair, I guess. For those of you who have been around since the very beginning of our channel, you would remember that Keldeo is the original Halucha for N. It's like someone took some dog poop in a bag Buried it in their backyard for about 20 years, then decided to dig it up and take a gigantic whiff. This is what this feels like right now. It's not cool. Wow, tell us how you really feel, and my goodness, I haven't heard hate against Keldeo like this since our last Keldeo box. If you guys don't know, uh, we have opened this box one time before, and it was our ninth video that we ever posted. So that is going back all the way to June 2014. It's been three years since we opened up one of these boxes, and I finally managed to find one at a decent enough price to relive the old memories, and I just, you know, I had to hear N's hate for Keldeo one more time. So this is actually a very cool product. Um, I really like it a lot. It's hard to believe that this thing is now five years old. That is nuts. How is this box five years old already? I, I, five years old of vomit. I don't understand it. So let's take a look vomit at this. Vomit age as well. <laughs> oh gosh. We've got a gigantic, uh, gigantic, we've got a giant promo of Keldeo EX, jumbo promo. We've got the Keldeo figure up here. We've got three packs of Pokemon TCG inside. We've got two Dragons Exalted and one Noble Victories. We also have a Keldeo promo here, black and white number 60. As you can see, there's that uh, little description there. And then on the very back of the box, it's time to read. Ahem. No. Bring mythical strength to every battle with the Pokemon TCG Keldeo box. One of the most recently discovered Pokemon five years ago is ready to take the battlefield with the talented trainer. Is it you? In the Pokemon trading card game, Keldeo box, you will find the cult Pokemon Keldeo as an impressive collectible figure and as two cool promo cards, a regular foil card and an awesome oversized one. Plus you get three booster packs from the Pokemon TCG black and white series expansions to help you charge into battle. I hate you. I'm ignoring <laughs> you completely right now. I guess that's fair. So let's go ahead and crack into this box here and look at everything a little bit closer up. I'm a little bit excited the fact that we've got two Dragons Exalted and one Noble Victories to open. That means we've got chances to get some pretty darn cool cards. Uh, Black and White Era had a lot of just neat stuff, so. Not to mention their boxes, much easier to open. Look at this, just plastic wrap and boom, it's already out of the box. Gotta love it. All right, so take this apart, get our little Keldeo figure going here. It does come with its own little stand and its hooves go in to the little, uh, little, little upraised platforms inside of this uh, little stand. So we're gonna put hoof number one, hoof number two, and hoof number three into the stand. If it wants to go in, Keldeo, get in the stand. There we go. So there, now you can see Keldeo in all of his resolute glory. <laughs> like I said, I'm not even acknowledging you right now. As the figure there. Here is our Jumbo Keldeo EX promo with Russian, the, which is funny because now Zorak has that same ability essentially. Uh, from Boundaries Crossed. I find that kind of ironic, you know, that Zorak copied Keldeo. Nothing? Nothing. Okay. Cool. All right, let me get this uh, promo card out of here, hopefully undamaged. Hey, we did it. All right, so here's the Keldeo promo. It's a little bit warped, but it's five years old, so what do you expect? Swords Dance and Aqua Blade are the two attacks. Black and white promo number 60. Kind of hard to believe that we are uh, uh, past XY and already on to Sun and Moon promos, very close to this number. Really, really crazy. But there's Keldeo as its uh, non-EX promo card. And we also have are two packs of Dragons Exalted and one pack of Noble Victories. Now, the real question here is, since N hates Keldeo so much, should I actually let him open up a Noble Victories pack, or should I just force him to open Dragons Exalted? Hmm. <coughs> uh, I guess I'll be kind. I guess I'll be kind. And why don't you come up here and open up your Noble Victories and go on a little full art end hunt? 
All right. Now all the puke is cleaned up. Actually, no, it's not. Go clean up the puke. <laughs> if there was actual puke, uh, I would be puking. Just saying. All right. Put you away. Let's see what we get. We got Carablast, Pimple, Litwick, Pimple. <laughs> Frillish, Tanamo, Garbodork, and... Not the end we were looking for. Nope. Cryogonal, Reverse Hollow Heat to more, and a Hydragon Hollow. Hey, you got a Hollow. And it was a Hydragon pack as well, by the way. Oh, cool. Not sure if you noticed that one. Keep that code, because we need to use it for the streams. Yes, we do. We own one full art end on the PTCGO, even after all this time, so we're still trying to get more all of those. Right. All right, let's go into Dragon's Exalted. We're gonna start off with a Giratina pack. Giratina EX is in this set, as well as Rayquaza and Mew. Those are the ones that I can remember at the moment. <laughs> it's been a long time since we've opened up this set. All right, here we go. We've got a Gibble, Buizel, Aeron, Wurmple. We got a Vulpix. We got a Palpitoad, Tool Scrapper. Actually, somebody was looking for this card not too long ago, too. Kind of funny that I pulled that one. We've got a Bulldor. Reverse Hollow is a Minchino and a Dustox non-hollow rare. So one more pack to go here, which is Gyarados. Oops, my bad. Uh, which actually is one of my favorite pack artworks of all time. This Gyarados looks so fierce and the color scheme between the blue and the green just looks really, really nice together. So I don't know, I just really, really like this pack art. All right, here we go. Oh, we're starting off with another Gibble. How about that? Gibble number two. One, two, three, one and two. All right, so again, we're starting off here with Gibble. Buizel, Aeron, another Wurmple, Vulpix, why is this pack looking so familiar? Giant Cape, Palpitoad, wait a minute, this is like the same pack. Floatzel, Garchomp is our reverse, and an Aggron Hollow. So we actually got a reverse Hollow rare and two Hollows out of this. But let me just take a quick look back here because I feel like that was like the same pack. All right, Gibble, Gibble, Buizel, Buizel. It's kind of rare when this happens, so I'm just curious to see. Yep, it went Gibble, Buizel, Aeron, Wurmple, Vulpix. That is the same cards, um, and Palpito too. What the heck? What are the odds of this happening? I don't think I've ever seen quite uh, <laughs> quite a a duplicate of this. That's like, what happens when you open up Puke. Look at this. All right, there's the first set. Ah, right there. And then right after that, we open up the same exact set. I can't seem to fan it out very well, but yeah, you get the point. Like there's two Gibbles, there's two Buizels, there's two Aerons, then there's two of these Wurmples here, which is hidden behind the Vulpix. There we go. Two Wurmples, two Vulpixes, and two Palpitoads. Six of the same cards are in two of the same packs. What in the world is going on with that? I don't think I've ever seen that before. They both had a tool card, granted they were different and just super weird. I don't know, that was crazy. I've never seen anything quite like that. But anyways, guys, let's do that short little recap here once again. We got an Agron, a Hydreigon, and a Reverse Hollow Garchomp, which actually, I don't know how many of you have been around for the game that long, but this deck was always right on the cusp of being decent uh, with Mock Cut and Dragon Blade. Mo mostly it was for Mock Cut. Uh, discard a special energy attached to defending Pokemon and do 60 damage for a single fighting energy. It was always so close to being such a good deck. I always wanted to make it work. So did you, right? Yeah, uh, kind of. At one point I did. Yeah, we, we did a couple of deck profiles uh, and a couple of matches with uh, Garchomp and just never made it really work. Nobody ever did. It sounded good, but it just couldn't make it in the format. So, And then, of course, we've got uh, Hydreigon here as well. All energy attached to this Pokemon are uh, dark energy instead of their usual type, which is really crazy. But, uh, and there was even a deck around this now that I think about it. Toppling Wind. When you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon, you may discard the top three cards of your opponent's deck. This was actually used in combination with Durant uh, to make a mill deck. So all three of these cards had some kind of weird... Uh, either ability or, or instance in the game. Kind of funny. But anyways, guys, we hope you enjoyed this Keldeo box. Uh, it's been a long time since we opened it, a long time since we've seen it, and they're full of packs that we just really enjoy. And my stomach did not miss it one bit. So I, I can tell you that right 
<laughs> I'm sure it didn't. But anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button, comment down below, subscribe for more TCG content here on the Pokemon Evolutionaries, and we will see you guys next time. I'm Professor K. And I'm Ben. We'll see you guys next time. Take care. Have a great day. <laughs>